Good morning. Daniel Gillespie here with the Clarity Crew, live on location at Wrightsville Beach. Okay, not really. I'm actually on location in the garage or our makeshift knife shop. Uh, I really did want to go down to Wrightsville Beach again today, but they are arresting people and charging them $500 if they are found down there. So I thought we would go with this. But I wanted to go down to Wrightsville Beach, not just because of the beauty of the backdrop, but also because often when I go down there, the sound of those waves in the background remind me of a passage in the book of Job, which reminds me of the greatness of our God. You see, Job begins a book about suffering and God's sovereignty, and it begins with a man named Job who is faithful, and he responds to trials, ridiculous trials, in a well-oriented fashion. He says, the Lord has given and the Lord has taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. But time and some poor counsel from some of his friends begin to eat away at that faith, and Job becomes disoriented. The Lord responds to Job's questions of why and how long and things like that, not with answers, but with his own questions. Rhetorically, God begins to ask Job if he was there when the world was made and if he knew where the snow was kept and was he there when God feeds the lions and he begins to put Job in his place. And one of the places in Job chapter 38 where he does this is he asks the question, or who shut in the seas with its doors and prescribed limits for it and set bars and doors and then said to the waves, thus far shall you come and no farther and here shall your proud waves be stayed. And I'm reminded as I think about that text that God is in control of everything. And when he says stop, it stops. He puts a limit on everything. The same is true with the trial that we have, with the virus that we are facing. There are bars and limits to it that the Lord knows. So just as certain as the waves stop where the Lord wants them to stop, so will this virus. If the Lord said, sit to this virus, it would sit. If he said, roll over and die, it would roll over and die. So instead of us spending much of our time asking how long or why, Let's instead look to the sovereign, good God of the universe and say, Lord, what would you have us do in this time? For the Clarity Crew, this is Daniel Gillespie, live on location from the garage.